Hey guys. Hey, so I've got another diamond painting here to open. So this one here is a 40 by 50. Um, I ordered it off Wish. Um, I will I can never say the store name, so I'm going to link it in the description. Um, and anyway, so this one here is, I kind of ordered this one last minute. And what this story is behind this one is, it is a 40 by 50 of a Sheltie. And a friend of mine, a very good friend of mine, um, has just lost her second Sheltie. And wanted to do something as a little gift for her um, to commemorate her puppy and stuff so anyway I decided to she sent me a picture of her dog and I ordered this diamond painting to kind of to look similar to her puppy so anyway um I am just gonna go ahead and rip into this and we will look at it together so okay so it's just come in a plain white box um yeah there we go um and the box is in good shape there's a few little dents here but the cardboard is very nice and thick and it looks like it's in very good condition so we're just gonna pull out what's in here let's empty it out oh my goodness all right so we have a great vacation of joys here we will take a peek at that in a minute let's take a peek and see what we've got for our canvas all right so the canvas looks pretty good um it does look like it is the um the opaque cover and what I have learned is that the opaque covers um, usually mean that the glue has not been poured on that it is um, basically like double back tape um, so anyway I've never done one like this before so I guess like all the ones that I've done have had clear covers so we'll see anyway I'm just gonna get this straight right, so the canvas is really nice it's kind of stinky but um, Anyway, I'm just going to pull this back here. It's very sticky. Um, the drill field looks quite clear. Happy about that. Very sticky. There we go. Now it's coming. Sorry. So one of the things I am always worried about with the size that I ordered is the clarity of the picture. But I think we're going to be okay. That looks really nice. Um, lots of detail on that. I think that this is going to turn out quite nice. So it is a shelty on a sitting on grass. So there's that. I'll do one more corner over here and see. I want to see what the bottom looks like because I don't know how big the uh, the actual dog is. And one of the concerns that I had was that this paint, this painting is going to be mostly background. So there's the drills. Oh, look at that. That's nice. That is really nice. So um, let me see. There's a few wrinkles in the canvas, but nothing major. It looks pretty good. And... It does look like the majority of the canvas is the puppy and with a little bit of green the picture was was a little bit deceiving this doesn't want to come up here well, you know what I'm pulling the adhesive up there stick it back down let's try this this the adhesive came up with the with the sheet I see what they mean what meant now by that um, that double back tape because that just pulled right up so oh that looks pretty good you can see the grass and there's it's sticky right through there's no no adhesive missing and I don't see any major rivers or anything so that's quite nice I'm happy with this it'll be a fun one to do I'll have to get this one kitted up and work. I think this will be my next project. I do have a couple other paintings in the mail. So let's take a look at our key here. So we have two, four, six, eight, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. I think there's 28, 32 colors there. Um, the symbols are all nice. They don't, doesn't look like there's any, um, there's the greater than sign. And that eight is a little hard to read, but looks like the symbols are all okay. So anyway, we'll take a minute. Right, so to kit here, we have a plate of wax. We've got the sharp 
tweezers. I've never actually gotten a pair of tweezers before. Um, single placer. Yeah, just a single placer, no three placer or anything, and just a few baggies. And I've got a tray with a cutout, so that's nice. So the drills here are in the package. Let's see how we get into this. Where do you start? Ooh, a short tape. Sorry, I needed both needed both hands to get this going. So it looks like there's a lot of greens. Really nice vivid colors. And this is a square drill. Oh, I forgot. I wasn't sure if it was a square or Okay, so wow, look at all these drills. We have lots of browns and greens in this one is what I was figuring, but the drills do look good. They look like they're in good good quality. It's a lot of this green, which I'm assuming is going to be the grass. There's quite a bit of that. We'll get an inventory sheet. There's the picture. And it's like her puppy. Maybe that, so. Anyway. And it looks like the inventory for this has been done. So my main color in this one is that green. Um, 895. So yeah, it looks like that's kind of my main color here is are these two green colors. So anyway, I think this is exciting gonna be an exciting one to do. And I'm really happy with the quality of it. I'll link the name of the store below. It's a 40 by 50. And there it is. So thanks, guys. I will update you on the progress of this one.